Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in Alessandro the Crypto here. I hope you're doing all fine. So Bitcoin finally had its breakout from this uh, consolidation wedge and we're gearing up here towards this $9,400 resistance. If we can break here this uh, red line, we should be good to go towards our main target of $10,500 before the halvening will happen in less than uh, eight days. So in the one hour, of course, now we are getting into overbought condition, but we have to see what will happen once we are gonna touch here this previous resistance here where we also topped out here at around $9,400. Are we seeing there maybe a little correction before a breakout here towards $10,000 or are we completely shooting up here towards $10,500 without seeing any correction? This is very possible in my opinion, but of course now in the smaller time frames we are overbought like here in the RSI and stochastic and also in the Bollinger Band we are overshooting it completely to the upside. So we're seeing now this current breakout let me know down below in the comments guys if you traded this and what is your entry the MACD now is shifted to the upside so the momentum is clearly now shifted to the upside here in the one hour four hour as well we bounce successfully from the 50 level here in the RSI stochastic is getting into overbought territory but here we can stay for quite some time before we're seeing a correction to the downside so in case that we are gonna get rejected here Watch out for the 20 moving average in the 4 hour at 8,935 this should be now acting as a support. So also here the previous line at 9,000 down here to 8,930 should hold as a support in case that we're gonna retrace and have a test here of this moving average after getting topped out here at 9,400. I still think there is a high chance that we could break it immediately, but let's see what will happen once we're gonna reach that. So far we are still pumping and it looks like that, that nothing can stop us currently. MACD had a bullish cross here here in the four hour we are also overshooting the Bollinger Band to the upside but that is normal after squeezing out in this tiny channel here and if we go into the bigger time frames here also you can see that we're still far away from the 220 daily moving average which are currently at around 8220 so in case that we're gonna see a bigger rejection here at this $9,400 this is also as you can see a lower high compared to this $10,500 high that we had over here so this would be still bearish and this could indicate that we're gonna go and retrace and test again the 20 or 200 daily moving average before another attempt to break it but in case that we can break it already now i think we're good to go to test again this 10,500 and hopefully also break it as you know in case that we're not breaking it this could be very very bearish also for the long term for bitcoin but in case that we can test it and break it successfully especially in the first attempt i think we're good to go for the big run towards 14 and maybe even twenty thousand the dollar again the rsi and stochastic here are overbought here in the daily so this is what is concerning me a bit and that's why i think there is a high chance that we maybe are getting rejected already here or at 10,500, at least to cool down a bit and test again the 15 the rsi and if we go and check here the bollinger band also here you can see that we are trading right at the top macd is still shifted to the upside but here also we could retrace any time soon here between 8,800 down to $8,000 again. So in case of a bigger correction or dump, watch out for these two levels here between 8,800 to $8,000. If we're gonna go and start to trade again below 8,000, this would be very bearish. But even if we would retrace back down here towards the 20 or uh, 200 daily moving average here at around 8K, this should be still fine for another attempt to break here this $9,400 and $10,500 resistance. But let's see if we can break it already now. This is just in case that we are gonna get rejected here at this point where we are right now or here at $10,500. And if we open up the weekly time frame, here you can see that we are trading now above the 15, the RSI, stochastic is still shifted to the upside. And we had now a couple of weeks all in green and we are successfully trading above the 20 and 50 weekly moving average, which is very bullish. So here we have a lot of 
fuel to the upside and if we can really break these two main resistances we could be in here for a big run to the upside because here in the weekly we are still having a lot of fuel left to the upside and even if we open up the Bollinger Band you can see that going up here towards this $10,500 is very likely to happen and also the MACD just had a bullish cross so here also we could see big big fireworks to the upside similar like we had here when we topped out at 14 thousand dollar so now all in all guys we are having a bullish momentum in the short and long term everything is showing up that we could be in for the beginning stage of a big run to the upside let's see if we can take out these highs here this is i think the last step before a big push to the upside which could take us easily here between 20 to 16 thousand dollar and potentially even higher especially if we are starting to pump also after the halvening event and remember guys if you need to open up a coinbase account where you can buy bitcoins with fiat or you want to trade with leverage over on bybit or femix for example you can use my invitation links that you find down below here in the video description because with my links you can get some sign up bonuses on coinbase you can get ten dollar for free if you open up an account and also with coinbase earn if you use coinbase you can get a lot of free altcoins completely free and you just have to use my invitation codes to get access to them and also if you open up our Bybit, Phoenix, Prime XPT or Bityard account you can get some sign up bonus especially this one over on Bybit is very useful this is my favorite exchange and here you can get $90 rewards if you're using my link so if you like the content please leave a like subscribe to the channel and we see us all in the next one bye